Hello everyone, it's VC Albert here and in this video I'll be showing you how to fix error WWE2K20.exe stopped working and more crashing issues for the game WWE2K20. So I've got some workarounds for this issue as I was going through the Steam forum of this game. This is the official Steam forum of the game WWE2K20. So I searched through this forum and I found some probable fixes for this issue so let's get started. So first of all, before performing any of the steps, what I'll recommend you to do is just clean boot your PC. And if you have any doubt regarding on how to clean boot your PC, I've made a separate quick guide on how to do it. You can find the description of that video in the link of this video. Just go to the description of this video and open that video. It's a two minutes guide and it's a really quick one. Watch it, clean boot your PC, then perform the further steps. So in the first step, we'll be changing the priority of the game. So as soon as you have run the game, you have to change its priority to high. So if you don't know how to change priority of anything to high, just go to your task manager. I won't be able to show you this for the game WWE2K20 as the PC I'm using for recording does not have this game. So all you have to do is, as soon as you have run this game, you will find it in this process under the apps. So I will show you how to do it for free download manager. You can do the same with the game WWE2K20. Right click on your game WWE2K20 and go to its details. And here, again right click on that file and set priority to high or real time. I do it to real time, so change its priority. So that's it for the first step and most probably this will fix your problem. But if it doesn't, then proceed to the second step. In the second step, we'll be uninstalling any Windows Media Codec Packs installed in your PC. So if you have installed Windows Media Codec Packs intentionally, then you know how to uninstall it. But if you don't know how to uninstall this, I won't be covering this in this video. So I will just provide you the link of this article in which they have shown how to uninstall a Windows Media Codec Pack if you have one. Well, it's quite simple. All you have to do is go to your Add or Remove Programs and search for Windows Media Codec Packs and uninstall them. But if you want details on how to do it, just go to this link. I will provide you this link in the description of this video. Now let's come to the third step. In this step, all you have to do is just right click on your WWE2K20.exe file. I will show you how to do it for Battle.net as I have already told you I haven't installed this game yet in this PC. Just go to its properties and basically if it was another game, I would have told you to run this program in compatibility mode for Windows 7. But for this game, I won't be recommending you this because the minimum requirements are of Windows 10. So just disable full screen optimization and run this program as an administrator and apply these settings and click on OK. So that's it for the third step and now most probably your problem will be fixed but if it still doesn't help just proceed to the last step. So the last step works for many users. All you have to do is just go to your games in game settings and in video settings change your mode from full screen or borderless windowed mode to window mode. Just switch it to windowed mode and this will work for you. So this is really simple on how to change to window mode but if you still have any doubt regarding this step just write in the comment section and if you have any doubt regarding any of the steps just write in the comment section so that's it for this video if this helped you please hit the like button below and also don't forget to subscribe for more thank you and have a nice day